Dream time. What is this? Is this going to even have an explanation for this ending in general? Or am I going to have to literally wait until if there is a true ending? I was alone. Like always. Toa, I think maybe... I think maybe your mother might not have been as good of a person as you think. I'm starting to wonder if maybe she... She purposely manipulated him as a kid. I wonder if there's even a chance she tried to kill him? And he thinks it was an accident himself? Or maybe that has something to do with a sister? I don't know. I don't know. There in the locked room, I lay curled in a ball on the bed with a blanket over my head. Shit. Hitting things with my fucking foot. Nothing but terrifying silence. It's cold. It hurts. Can't breathe. I want to go outside. I want to run around. I want to explore. I want to talk to somebody. These sound nothing like Toa. And if I can't do any of that, I want to hold someone's hand. Oh, okay, I thought he was going to say I'd rather die. That was what I yearned for. My hands are always being grabbed and yanked, but never held. I want to hold hands. I don't care who it is. I want to lace my fingers with theirs. Just then, a giant dark shadow leaned over me. You know what I really like about this artwork? It gives me, like, creepy-ass children's vibes. For, like, a children's book kind of thing. For a moment, I braced myself, but then a dry, coarse warmth enveloped my hand. This has to be Taku he's dreaming about when he was younger. It has to be. Relieved, I relaxed my body. I couldn't see the shadow's face, but I could sense that they were worried for me. Their callous palm rested atop my hand and gently squeezed. It was deeply reassuring. I was just so happy that someone was holding my hand. I awoke from a distressing dream. At some point, I had drifted back to sleep. My whole body was slick with sweat, my ears were ringing, and my breathing was elevated. But at least the crushing feeling in my skull had receded slightly, probably thanks to Taku's pills. Slowly, I eased myself up into a sitting position and let out a breath. Every time I moved my body, my vision swayed. For a while, I sat still, but then I noticed my throat was intensely dry and started craving booze. Using my left hand, I pushed myself off the bed and inched my way to the mini bridge. Then I opened the little door and grabbed a bottle at random without even looking at the label. Probably not a good idea. I uncapped it and immediately started chugging. The chill of the alcohol felt good, clearing a bit of the haze from my mind. Taco again? After I drained it, I set the empty bottle on the table, and a moment later, there came a knock at the door. I figured whoever it was would let themselves in with a key card, so I waited for that to happen, but it didn't. Dragging my leaden body, I walked to the door. On the other side, I found someone I belatedly realized was Taku. At first, I couldn't tell because he was hanging his head, and I couldn't sense his usual energy. He felt like a different person. Taku. I called out to him cautiously, but he walked in without responding. 
I closed the door, then turned and watched him walk to the other side of the room. He wasn't acting like himself. The smoke had turned dark red, its many tendrils swaying like smoldering embers. To me, it looked like he was trying to hold something in. He came to a stop, his back turned, and finally began to speak. He looked over his shoulder, his expression concealed by shadow. The question was so sudden, I couldn't parse what he meant. I frowned slightly. He cut in loudly, and I blinked at him dubiously. The fact that we're not seeing Taku is actually a little scary to me. ダキョ。本当は全力で暴力を振るわれたり、傷つけられたりする方が興奮する。でも、そんなの好き好んでやるやつなんてそういない。だから妥協してる。盛り上がって発散する瞬間だけは似てるからな。暴力も。He muttered quietly, then slowly turned to face me. Excuse me? He pulled something from his pants pocket. A small scalpel. His eyes glinted darkly as he stared me down. Um, I'm sorry, what? He's gonna cut the web tag out. The next instant, he lashed out with a scalpel in his right hand. <laughs> Instinctively, I recoiled backwards to dodge it. But the motion made my body ache. With my broken arm, I didn't have my usual flexibility. Oh my. <laughs> he swung the scalpel again and I dodged sideways, but I staggered and tripped over my own feet. He left in at that moment, and the tip of the blade sent a sharp pain shooting through my cheek. With my gaze fixed on him, I crouched down and edged backwards toward the door. I don't think he could if he wanted to. With a growl, he charged at me. Then he grabbed me by the shoulders and slammed me against the wall. <laughs> He was so strong, you'd never know he had a gunshot wound. As he crushed me against the wall, I slid down to the floor. Find out what changed Taku. Oh, fuck. Great. <laughs> My favorite part of the game because I suck. No because I want to say it sarcastically. I'm so fucking good at it. So I guess I gotta break the hourglass. Correct. Oh my. Okay. Save time. Taku's looking at me, but isn't really seeing me. Could this possibly lead to a bad ending then? Because... I don't think I can talk my way out of this. Why? Positive. Am I really stressing you out this much? <laughs> Keep talking. No choice but to give up.
Have you given up on everything? I am actually curious if this will lead me to a bad ending. Yeah. Okay. It's... It's... Makes me think. Go further, uh. then. <sighs> Did you quit thinking for yourself? I don't know. I told you, this is the conclusion I came to. You said you'd grant my wish. Uh. Taku is looking at me intently. Provoke him a little, gently pacify him. Do you really think provoking him at a time like this is a good idea? Let's try Negative. it. <laughs> Trying to copy Euphoria? Delve a little deeper. That's the answer. Tell me what led to this. Ah. Uh, so. Spill it. Tell me what led to this. <laughs> Suddenly he raised a scalpel high in the air. He's going to kill me. And soon the as soon as the thought crossed my mind, I felt myself accept it. Not like my life was important or had any value. I was gonna have to die sooner or later. Right now, it was looking like sooner, but so what? The thought process took less than a second. And yet, to me, it felt like an eternity. His eyes are dark and quiet. Okay, just out of curiosity. A give up leads me to an ending. Negative. Ah, so. Fine, whatever. <laughs> he swung the scalpel down. Quietly, I closed my eye. There was a strange, airy sound as an impact collided with my body. Confused, I opened my eye and saw the scalpel sticking out of my right arm. Or more accurately, the cast. <laughs> Taku gritted his teeth like he was biting something back as he stared at the scalpel. His stiffened cheeks were trembling faintly. For a split second, he looked deeply fragile, like he could shatter at any moment. <sighs> I reached out with my left hand and cupped his cheek. The instant I touched him, he snapped to his senses. His face crumpled, and he flung the scalpel to the floor. <gasps> oh my god! Then he pulled me into a tight embrace. So tight it made my bones creak. So tight it was hard to breathe. But I didn't pull away. Take <laughs> His breathy, quavering voice crushed against my ear. ダメだ。やっぱり。お前を殺すなんてできない。殺す。なんでそんなことになったんだ。俺の力じゃ。お前を守りきることができない。だったらいっそ、俺自身の手で。お前を。大好きな母親の形見がトウノの愛人になって、そんなにショックだったのか。違う。Oh. I was pretty sure I had the right idea, but Taku denied it firmly. His eyes were shining with determined his eyes were shining with determination. Mukashua. 
つの間にか自分でも本当に気づかないくらいに変わっていたんだ俺は最近お前の夢を見る夢大体の夢は悪夢だったって感覚が残ってるだけで内容はよく覚えてないけど最近は夢の中でお前がいるってわかる Sorry, I'm just trying to see what I might want to use for like a, a thumbnail Taku's lips curled in self-deprecation 悪夢としてかいや夢の中の俺は子供で何か恐ろしい存在に怯えてるけどお前が出てくると安心する<笑>お前から傷の治療や診察を受けてる時夢の中と同じ懐かしさを感じるんだ Taku closed his eyes and pursed his lips like he was trying to hold something in. When he opened his eyes again, they were brimming with resolve. <laughs> I could hear the pain in his voice. I gotta get him to talk. <laughs> What should I get out of him? When Rai said talk is overprotective of me. Okay, first of all, save. I don't, I don't fucking know. Okay, um, when Rai and said, when Rai said talk is overprotective of me. Overprotective, studying, nasty rumors. All this time. This one has to be all this time then. For the love of God, give it to me. Fuck, it's wrong. You're right, I'm sorry. すまない。I don't, I don't, I, I don't. Uh, uh, excuse me? Taco looked away sadly. I forget it. w e l l silent. You fucking. I can't call you an idiot. That was my choice. Fucking give up like that. Load. Okay. So. Overprotective. So Ray said Taku's a p r o t e c t i v e of me. Can you use this twice? Because it's orange. They're all orange. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I guess this? Yeah.、Kahumo. I think that was it. Yep. I'm going to use Kahogo. レイが言ってた。Oh, I forgot they speak. だろうな。ずっと、お前のことを気にかけていた。子供の頃から面倒を見てるんだ。そうなるのも、仕方がないだろう。Okay, one down, one more to go. Gotta find what Taco's true desire is. You. Fucking you. お前の望みを教えてくれ。俺が、本当は、何をしたかったのか。タク。うん。Oh my god, we're back to this. Fucking wonderful. Fucking. Fucking wonderful. I sense some kind of hesitation from him. This is fucking me so bad. I need some water. Purposely ask him, ask bluntly. Alright, so am I trying to get the euphoria to go up then? Is that the point right now? Negative. Do you want to do it? 
<laughs> you have something to hide? No, nothing like that. Okay, I think I did that correctly. Think being the keyword. Oh, god damn, I keep hitting that thing under my desk. Sarcasm. Conviction. Huh. Who am I? So you're gonna run away? <laughs> okay. Press him harder. Yes. Just tell me what you want. Mm. Fuck this. Load. I got... I think what I'm trying to do is get the hourglass to go back up, but I, I can't tell for sure. Yes. Was it that one? Who am I? <laughs> yeah, it was. Okay, so... Uh. Maybe actually it was better to say nothing. To me it looks like you stopped trying at all. So... Donna. Yeah, maybe I have. Oh! I, that was... Oh, okay. All right, so don't you dare run away. <laughs> Let's try that again. Who am I? <laughs> Press him harder. Try just ah. tell me what you want. So <laughs> Let's say nothing. That was the wrong choice, wasn't it? Oh my. Did I mention I am not good at this? How about this one? <sighs> Looks like you already know the answer. Show affection. Want to die with me? Are you interested? Okay, well, if you're trying to show affection, this one would be it, wouldn't it? Yoshi. I'm interested to know what exactly you want. Mm. Interested? Be blunt. Spill my uh. guts, I guess. Sounds uh. pretty blunt to me. Well, spit it out already. Uh. I do want to talk to you, but... I'm not really sure what it is I'm feeling. Hold on. Are you fuck- did I fuck up again? Alright, obviously I'm missing something. Oh god damn it, I keep fucking doing this shit! Say nothing. Oh that was it, that was- not a good idea, right off the bat. Okay. Let's try uh. this. Okay. Hold on. This game is gonna get mad at me if I keep doing this. Alright, I'm trying to pay attention now to the background with the, uh... Oh the lines. <laughs> okay, they're glowing. Press them harder. Uh. <clears throat> so. Shit, I fucked up again. Okay. What am I supposed to do? There is no way I'm looking up a guide for this. Yes. I, I don't think I meant to click oh that one. <laughs> it's glowing. Okay. 
Your choice but to give up. Okay, say nothing is not a good idea. Tell me what you want. Okay, now it's closing. No choice but to give up. Okay, it's closing again. The way things stand, I can't see where you're coming from at all. Right. Okay, it's glowing. Oh my god, did I finally... What, what am I doing wrong? At this point, I'm really unsure of what I'm supposed to do. Okay. That's the answer. Yes. We'll go with that one. <sighs> Might die. Doしたい? Wanna die with me? So. I considered that. Oh my god, I really don't understand what... What does... Does this want me to fi figure out? Does this want me to work on the... How do I know what Taka's true desires are? Okay, sure. Hold on. Conviction, interest, confirmation, uncertainty, sadness... Maybe if I look at these... Okay, if I want to press him... Conviction... Sarcasm. Conviction, yes. then. Oh, my. <laughs> Press him harder. If I'm gonna press him harder... <laughs> so... No, I did it again! Oh my fucking god. Maybe I'm not... You know what? You know what? You know what? <gasps> Shit, no. That's not what I meant to do. At fucking all. Okay, let me look at this one. What is this one? Did oh ask bluntly, purposely asking. Positively. Hanase. Then tell me the truth. I don't know what point. I don't remember where this is in the game, to be honest. So. Press him. That's the answer. Don't you dare run. <laughs> <laughs> Press him harder. <laughs> so mm. Prompt him. Yes. <laughs> so. Provoke him. Ah. So Taco is terrified of what might change if he confessed the truth. He is scared that I would reject him and then things would never go back to the way they were before. And no amount of me telling him otherwise would truly convince him. The only thing that could prove it to him was all the time we'd spent together. What had I felt with him over the years that led to today? I would have to talk about it. Taku mentioned something about how long we'd known each other. Overprotective, studying, nasty rumors, debt, drugs, all this time! Is this finally it? Holy shit, finally. God damn. Oh 
前とは長い付き合いだああお前はおとなしい子供だった静かにうつむいて俺の診察を受けていた注射にも声一つ出さずこっちが不安になるくらいになだから気になって仕方がなかった頭の片隅にいつもお前のことがあったもう迷うことはないな全部お前にとって譲れないものがあったからそのためにやったそうだよなはあそうだ Oh my god, no, oh, no, no, it's gonna break. I think that's it. I think it's done. I think I did it. Finally. Oh my god. I was a kid when I was a kid. I was a kid when I was a kid. I was a kid when I was a kid. I was a kid when I was a kid. I was a kid when I was a kid. 初めは純粋な親心みたいなものだったこの子の成長をこれから先もずっと見守りたいとそう思っていただがお前が成長するにつれて何か俺の中で違う気持ちが芽生えているような気がしたんだそれも長年見守ってきた情なんだろうと思ってたそう納得してたんだなのにお前がボロボロになって帰ってきたことがあっただろう Which time? I thought back to that day The shootout that took out my right eye That's what happened to his eye At Shinkumi General Hospital, Taku removed my exploded eyeball. Personally, I didn't miss it much, but it must have changed me on the subconscious level. Granted, I was always a bit of a vagabond, but after that incident, I stopped coming home almost entirely. That said, I was living alone in a condo that Sakaki acquired for me, so I wasn't too attached to it. It was around then that Euphoria first started painting people's desires too. As a result, I started getting injured more often, and Taku would chew me out while he administered first aid. Then he opened his clinic, and I started coming by to get eye checkups. When I heard the third floor apartment was empty, I started hanging out there whenever I was bored. Then, at some point, I progressed to sleeping there. Taku always rolled his eyes at me, but never tried to kick me out. On the contrary, he said it made my appointments a lot quicker. After that, I officially moved in. Later on, I went a little overboard and got badly injured during a euphoric episode. I was still an amateur at reading people, and the guy did a number on me. As I walked down the street, dripping blood, I was sure I was going to die that night. The next thing I knew, I was standing outside the clinic. I could still remember the look on Taku's face. He was so enraged, you'd think the whole world had come to an end. Ano toki. 本当は苦しくて悔しくて気が変になりそうだった今考えると笑える話なんだが真面目な顔でお前の怪我の手当てをしながら心の中ではパニックになってたんだ自分でも抑えきれなくて悩んで悩んで悩み抜いて結局考えるのをやめたお前のひどい姿を見て
一時的なショックを受けただけで忘れちまえば収まるだろうとだがお前が朝倉に傷つけられた姿を見た時また同じ苦しさがよみがえってきてそれで気づいたんだ俺はお前を失いたくない絶対に手放したくないって<笑>お前はおふくろさんに似てないよまったくな As he spoke, a small bashful smile crept up on his face. お前のそばにいたいできることならお前をずっと守りたい今はそう思ってる He hung his head like he had run out of energy. ひどいこと<笑>俺はお前に<笑> He grimaced bitterly Then I realized what he was probably about to say 俺に埋めたウェブタグのことか<笑> His eye flew his eyes His eyes flew open and he looked at me in disbelief どうしてそれをいろいろあってエイジから俺の部屋に電話がかかってきたその時に全部聞いたエイジかタクスロンチショーダーズディフィー本当にやったんだなああ Without looking up, he continued. きっかけは朝倉に傷つけられたお前の姿を見た時だった朝倉の傷の縫合手術をした時にお前の背にウェブタグを埋めたんだあの時の俺は完全に同化してた手術を終えて冷静になると後悔が押し寄せてきた本当に謝っても許されないことをした。だが、朝倉のことがあってから、俺は最悪の状況ばかり考えるようになった。ふらふらと出歩くお前が、俺の知らないところで手遅れになったら。その考えが頭をちらついて気が狂いそうだっただとしてもそんなことは言い訳にならない許してくれとは言わない本当に悪かったウェブタグは必ず取り出すお前が望むなら今すぐにでも Emotion welled up and his expression twisted in pain. Come to think of it, he had a stud of Tuno. Is he being blackmailed? Taku owed a debt to Tuno. Is he going to dedicate the rest of his life to Tuno? I don't know. Um, can we kill Tuno by chance? Wow, this is a really bad time to be doing this, but whatever. He, Taku feels that he owes Tuno. Tuno helped pay for Taku's education. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, we have no clues. The palette's clean. That means we'd be done with this chapter soon. Coin. Haha, we are all to scare at a cat on a chicken. 何かを失うということがとてつもなく怖い
許されなくてもいいと本当に思ってるのか Quietly, I broke my extended silence and he stiffened. So, I'm going to look at you. Hesitantly, he met my gaze. Is he going to be able to do it? I stared straight into his eyes. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. Oh, the moment the words left his lips, I balled my left hand into a fist and decked him in the face. <laughs> I wasn't used to punching with my left hand and it tingled. This <laughs> <laughs> Burring his brow, he gritted his teeth and stared at the floor. <laughs> his voice shook ever so slightly. Just then, there came a knock at the door. Shit, great. Someone to interrupt the, <laughs> Someone to interrupt the scene. That's great. I love it. <laughs> Taku looked up and glared sternly in the direction of the sound. It was the meathead who had it out for me. Taku walked to the door. He opened it and the other man peeked in. What? You? I was looking at the scene. That's right. My wife got out of the scene. After one hour, I'll return to the scene. Taku quietly closed the door, then walked back to me. He wore a bit of. Uh, yeah. He wore a bitter scowl on his face. Silently, I moved to get up, but Taku gently pressed a hand to my shoulder to stop me. <laughs> Without a word, he gazed into my eye. His fingers dug into my shoulder. <laughs> Biting his lip, he shook his head. ダメだ。愛人なんてやめろ。ここにいる限り無理だ。俺の方が無理だ。out of nowhere, he started screaming, then he grabbed my elder's shoulder. The look in his eyes had surpassed desperation straight into madness. Quietly, I gazed back at him. He closed his eyes in resignation, then looked at me once more. お前は、どうしたい？家よ。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す。通す
俺だけを見てほしいと思ってるだから遠野の愛人なんてやめろ His fingers slowly grew tighter and tighter. I let out a chuckle and he scowled. 人に言わせておいて笑うなよいや昔からずっとこうだったと思って昔からタクはいつも俺のことを心配して真剣に俺を見てた。Every time he examined me, it triggered this ticklish sense of nostalgia, and I found it strangely soothing. I had probably always felt it, but only after I began to focus on Taku did I truly become aware of it. It was a feeling drawn out from the forgotten memories of my past. When I was a kid, I probably yearned for my appointments with Taku. Whenever he showed up, that was how I knew I'd be alright. After all, he would always make the pain go away. When I was young, I must have sensed that he was the only one who seriously cared about my well being. Obeyed, Noka. Mukashi no koto. Nan to nak. Sorani, you may know my god, the kid at the it tadaro. Toshkani. Kodomo no koro no reva. O my god, kurito and shinsta. お前が来るのをずっと待ってたこいつは唯一俺を守ってくれる大人だって思ってとはそう考えるとこうしてずっと一緒にいるのも不思議なことじゃないのかもなお前のそばにいるのは居心地がいいって思ってたんだから What the hell is that? Oh, that's his gunshot. Furthermore, I'd never admit it out loud, but I could remember how I felt when Taku got shot. In that moment, I felt like I'd suddenly lost my. Wait, what? In that moment, it felt like I'd suddenly lost my footing in the world. If I had to guess, it was probably the fear of losing him. I had never confronted that feeling until the moment I thought he might have died. Now I understood. That was the moment I stopped taking him for granted. He looked at me in confusion. And he fixed me with a probing gaze. そうだが正直恋愛感情だとかそういうのはよくわからないけど俺はずっとお前のそばにいるのは悪くないと感じてたとはそれに面白い言葉も聞けた面白い I let the silence fall. Holding eye contact, I slowly leaned in. Who can no dareka ni toraleru kurai nara korosu nante? Omae no kuchi kara kiku to wa omoana katta. Yeah, I should have guessed that was probably a turn on for him. Dareka ni torale na katta to shitara. Ore ga omae no mono ni naru to shitara, dou suru no ka? Oshie ra ya. <laughs> squinting, uh, squinting affectionately, he reached out and gently stroked my cheek. Then his hand slid behind my head and pulled me close. <laughs> then, hesitantly, he looked away, then he let out a breath and with all of his courage pressed his lips to mine. <laughs> It was soft for a moment, and then he pulled away. 
This repeated a few more times, then I nibbled lightly on his lower lip. I'm kind of feeling some sexual tension coming. Wait, okay, I thought the music changed. Kissed me passionately this time, plunging his tongue into my mouth. I welcomed it without hesitation and extended my own tongue in kind. His arms around me tightened as his kiss grew more intense. The feeling of his wet tongue on mine made the back of my skull tingle. How long had it been since I last relished the simple sweetness of physical intimacy? I know they're just kissing, but still. I, I, I don't know what I can actually show of this. I mean, I can't... Uh, how I'm gonna edit this, whatever. Our lips made a sticky wet sound as they came together, slowly melting away each other's sense of rationality. What I desired most was the thrill of pain. Normally, these sweet tickles would do nothing for me. And yet, for some reason, I found it arousing. Probably because he was someone I wouldn't have considered before now. Besides, I hadn't kissed like this in a long time, so I probably just wasn't used to it. His tongue retracted and he pulled away briefly, pressing his forehead to mine. Oh, it was clear he was worried for my injuries. I chuckled. Classic Taku, always dutiful and kind. With a wry smirk, he stripped off his white lab coat. Then he cut my cheeks in both hands, almost like he was checking my temperature, and pressed his lips to my neck. <laughs> okay. Okay. After we caught our breath... Oh, actually... Palette's clean. That must mean this chapter is going to be over soon. All right, so three pa- All right, cool. We have three pages for Taku. So, Lady Taku is acting weird, hiding something. He has a debt with the gang, making drugs at Tuna's request. Is he being blackmailed? Now I know how Taku really feels. He finally told me everything. When I'm with him, it reminds me of how safe I felt with him as a kid. All right, yeah, now let's fucking continue the game. After we caught our breath, I pulled off the rest of my clothes and climbed into bed. Huh? Tell what your clothes were, like, completely off when you were having sex with Taku. I don't know what you're talking about. But this is as far as I got, obviously. I hadn't noticed any pain while we were in the act, but now that it was over, my broken arm was screaming at me. I was thinking to myself when they were having sex, okay, like, Toa's arm was in a cast because he broke it. Actually, he didn't break it. It was, um, that dickhead. Not Ari Moore. What's his name? Tuno. Nothing I couldn't handle, but when Taku found out about it, he gave me painkillers on the first aid kit and a cup of water. 
I took the pills with some water, then laid myself down on my back. Taku sat on the edge of the bed. I'm really wondering how this is going to go now between Taku and Toa, because they'd already had sex previously, but we didn't really have the time to take in the fact that that was their first time having sex. Wow. We didn't really have the time to take in the fact that that was our first time having sex together. And sorry if my voice sounds kind of weird tonight. Um, I don't know what's going on with it. <laughs> oh, right. I forgot to punch him and said, yeah, now we're even. Uh. I wonder if Toa is actually going to genuinely... Gen um, I wonder if Toa is actually going to have a genuine smile on his face at the end of this uh, chapter. So Relieved, he nodded to himself and let out a tired laugh. I saw him an inquiring look, then he slowly shook his head. <sighs> yeah. He gazed wistfully into the distance. だが、お前のお袋さんは仕事で家を空けることが多かった。だが、お前のお袋さんは仕事で家を空けることが多くてな。そういう時、俺がよく様子を見に行ってたんだ。お前、あの頃は全然喋らなくてな。笑ったり
それなんだけど I used my left arm to push myself into a sitting position. He hastily reached out to help me. Tono は本土の連中を巻き込むためのパーティーを計画していて、開催されるのは一週間後。そのために薬の完成を急いでるんだよな。Oh my god, I completely forgot. Tell, tell what? Taku doesn't know about all that shit. Oh, he's just. 一週間後の午後五時だ。俺たちがトーノに捕まる前。イガラシがクリニックの地下から薬の試作品を盗んだって知ってるかそうだったのか He pressed a hand to his mouth in contemplation. トーノには報告しなかったんだが確かに試作品が消えていただから間違いなく誰かが入ったとは思ってたんだそうか五十嵐君だったか試作品は今エイジが持ってるエイジはそれを本土の警察へ持っていくつもりらしいけどそれだけじゃ遠野を潰すには弱いからお前に証言してほしいって<笑>なるほど証言か Don't forget the part where he's gonna have to end up getting arrested fucking tell him Unsurprisingly, he looked conflicted about it. If he testified, he would get arrested too. Why? This is blackmail! Isn't, am I wrong? I thought blackmailing someone was illegal. <laughs> If Tuno cared that much about the fact that, oh, I'll pay for your college, then that would be considered a loan or technically a gift. I watch a lot of Judge Judy, okay? I know what I'm talking about. Sometimes. Rarely. Occasionally. Occasionally is more than rarely, I'm pretty sure, but you get the point. Yeah. He lowered the hand from his mouth and nodded firmly. Yeah. The thing is, can we leave now, finally? Ah. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. No,、uh, no, 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 Taku, honey, I can't have you in jail. I need Toa to have a happy ending. And you, and you. So, Ka. Dekir dake jigan kasegi o shite kure. Eiji kara mata renraku ga aru hazza kara. Uh oh. Just then someone started pounding on the door. That's not good. Oi. Nete ru no ka. Uh, Taku, either you have to hide or. Taku rose to his feet and answered the door. There stood Tuno, visibly furious. Bitch, you have no idea how much I want someone to just, you know, take a scalpel and just kind of really slowly across the neck. He scoffed. Tony Kaku, Toa, Zetai Anseda. Ursai, oh my, Xiriva Dosta. Mo can say Sternoka. Medo a tatter, Ato Scosta. だったら早く仕事に戻れもう時間がない間に合うかは保証できないと最初に言っただろう時間が足りないとそれでも終わらせるという契約だああ分かってる当たり前だ With that warning, he walked off. Okay, bye. Taku sighed, shut the door, and returned to the bed. Tono was kind of irritated. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm 
お前は部屋から出ないようにしてくれああエイジから連絡があったら伝える As expression step, he stroked my hair and left the room.